Hey, what's up guys? So today we are gonna go ahead and try out Old Forts Forester um, 1897 bottled and bond. Uh, so they call this the 1897 uh, because it's uh, that's the year when the bottle and bonding occurred. Um, basically what was happening in the US is bourbons were being made, uh, all different variants of it. And in order to mitigate bad bourbons, uh, they decided to, um, to make a bonding process. So um, people weren't getting like all the different chemicals, I guess. Um, that some companies were making at the time, or distillers. So they came came, came up with it in, the, in 1890. They owed Forrester 1897, I guess, is their uh, original recipe. Um, it's 100 proof. Uh, and I believe that it's like 70% corn, uh, a little bit of wheat. Um, and I don't know the rest about it, and maybe I should have done a little bit of research before to research before I do this. But I have a shitty whiskey review, and really I just talk about the appearance, the nose, uh, the palate, and the finish. Uh, the rest of it, I guess you guys can do your own research if you want me to. If you want me to do some more history to uh, what I'm drinking, and I guess maybe I can, but kind of just do this for fun and. Like I said, it's a shitty whiskey review anyway. So, and I, But I still hope that you uh, continue to follow me, like, subscribe, do all those other thingies. Uh, let's get to it. All right. So, um, beer, can you see this? Uh, dark amber. Dark amber in color. Um, oh, man. It's like classic bourbon, caramel, and vanilla right off the bat. Caramel, vanilla, in like a dark roasted coffee. That's what I'm getting. I'm getting a little bit of the uh, alcohol also, but it's not too bad. It's like beer lily there, it's a hint of it. All right. It's like a baked apple. Um with like sugar put in it, like sugar baked apple. Uh, you ever been to Old Country Buffet? What's it called? What's that called? Not called Old Country Buffet, like one of those old country stores, uh, or country restaurants, and they sell like the the, the apples uh, together. It's kind of like that, but not with the without the spices. Yeah, sweet baked apple, uh, definitely getting cherry. And uh, uh, you're definitely getting some oak in there, too. The, the finish lingers. It's a lingering finish, which is not a bad lingering finish because the lingering finish is that baked apple and the cherry and the toasted oak, uh, that little bit of sweetness. But it has, like... There's like a moment of like a kick of pepper. Um, and then it, it has a slow burn going, uh, a slow linger burn going down too. It's not like overpowering uh, burn either. Um, it's good. I recommend it. It's good. Uh, Old Forester, 1897, bottle and bond. It's 100 proof. Uh, it's good. I think you can get it for like 50 bucks, 40 bucks, 50 bucks um, at your local... Uh, liquor store and uh, check it out if you guys have tried it let me know um, what you think of it and if I'm missing any notes or whatnot um, yeah so cheers guys